fighter jets all have that long, skinny needle on the nose. Is it for breaking the sound barrier? Not at all. That little spike is called a pitot tube, and every airplane has one. Its entire job is to tell the aircraft exactly how fast it's really moving through the air. Here's how it works. As the plane pushes forward, air rushes straight into a tiny opening at the front of the pitot tube. That pressure is called dynamic pressure. Then, small side holes measure the outside air pressure, or static pressure. Compare the two pressures, and you get the real airspeed. It looks as thin as a drinking straw, but it's basically the pilot's extra set of eyes. When it goes wrong, things can get ugly. In the 2009 Air France 447 crash, iced over pitot tubes caused the airspeed readings to jump all over the place. And the confusion that followed led to a fatal chain reaction. That's why before every single flight, mechanics give the pitot system a full checkup. They use a tiny probe to clear out every hole. Only after the pitot system passes, everything is the aircraft cleared to fly. Why do fighter jets all have that long, skinny needle on the nose?